tonight's video I wanted to go through carry up on my promise to explain how we're gonna make um, the acoustic guitar into an electroacoustic so I've got our standard um, strength bank D1 acoustic and this is a piezo pickup I'm gonna use one of these it's gonna be the simplest trick I'm going so we've got this I'm gonna hook it up to the output uh, where you plug in the guitar. And let me show you how that works. So I've got another blank, an old blank um, guitar. So it's the same sort of thing. Now here you've got this bridge piece, the same on the other guitar. But what you do is you take it out and the signal is gonna be picked up from the vibrations of this when it's sat in there. So first things, I get the drill. And I'm doing it from the bass side. I'm gonna drill a hole so that I can feed the lead through. Um, I've already power drilled this. Simple as that. <laughs> Looks like I'm destructing the guitar, but I'm not. So we've got this lead. But this won't fit through the hole, so I want to cut off this one. I've done this before, just like Blue Peter. So I've cut off the end, and I just kind of roll back uh, the sleeve on it. But first of all, it gets put through the hole I've just made in the guitar. And this is so I can hook up this pickup um, to an amplifier. So as you can see, it goes through that. So I pull that out. And that fits in the gap. Now, before you do that, what you can do is use like a screwdriver just to channel out and make it a bit deeper if you need be. Then the bridge sits back on top of this piezo electroacoustic pickup. So that would go there. And then when we put the guitar strings in, the tension of the strings over this bridge piece is going to transfer the vibrations and they'll be picked up by this lead here. So once this is in, we would need to connect it up and wire to the top and the ground of these two. And then I'll let's tape it up because when it's in the guitar, you can get a lot of cross circuits with it wavering around. So I put a bit of tape on there. And then I want to mount, mm, I think somewhere about, about there. So that's where I'm gonna plug the guitar into. And I like to get it so it's kind of easy. It's not in the way when you're playing but it's down there and easy to grab. And then somewhere in a line between the bottom corner over the bridge piece there to the middle bits, uh, somewhere in that line. So I'm gonna get it there and then literally, there. So that's the start of the hole um, where I've got it. So then I get a bigger, bigger drill bit so I can fit in um, this pickup. Now, here's one I've done earlier. This again is our um, D1 black acoustic guitar. It's our bestseller. It's my favorite. Um, I've got about a dozen of these that I want to turn into this and put them up for sale. They're ones that have been knocking around, they're all black, ski ones. Um, this one's already got a couple of scratches on it just from where I've been working on it, but it's a set of 12 that I want to get done. 
Sag, ja. So that's just the guitar, but we've already got installed under there the piezo pickup. Fed through to there, connected to the guitar pickup, drilled into the body, and I plug this into the amp. So now if I turn the amp on. to turn any guitar into an electroacoustic, but I have a dozen of those, these um, made, ready for sale online. So please subscribe. I've got loads more, loads more to do. And I'll catch you next time. Right, and...